What's up everyone? Welcome to a brand new unboxing. Today I got something in the mail. It's from Funko. It's for one of their fun days things. It comes with three pops. I don't know what's in them. It's a mystery kind of thing. It cost me like $56, so I'm hoping there's some cool ones in here. I'm not expecting much. I don't have the best of luck when it comes to kind of things like this, but I want to give you guys my reaction to it. Of course, I also want you guys to know, I just want to start doing more of this. If you guys like these types of videos, hit that like button. Also, tell me down below that you guys want me to do more of these. Maybe I'll do some Blu-ray hauls or other Comic-Con hauls and Funko Pop hauls. But without further ado, let's get straight into it. guys so here's the box I'm gonna get it a little bit closer to you guys so it looks kind of like a stranger things kind of thing you got a uh, Dustin down here stranger things Hawkins high school Freddie rules so that's kind of cool so it looks like a little locker you have a little nickname down there hugs not drugs over here um, Beth remember Beth 20 years of fun it's crazy that Funko's been around for 20 years now it's just a huge phenomenon um, if it ain't Funko it ain't fun apparently even though their website sucks sometimes and then um, the top says Funko's fun days 2018 this is a really cool box um, some other cool nice memorabilia on the other side of it and then okay this part's cool that is the Demogorgon or one of the cool little Demogorgons I don't remember what they called it at the end of Stranger Things but I'm gonna call it a Demogorgon but let's look it so I'm gonna let you guys see the first thing oh okay so let's look at these let's let's look at these I'm gonna be honest none of the ones I wanted which kind of sucks. Really wanted the uh, Freddy Funko of it. But yeah, these are pretty cool, not gonna lie. So let's just go through them one by one, kind of just talking about each one. So these are Freddy Funkos. These are like the Freddy like of it. And each of these are limited. So this is limited to 5,000 pieces. This is my Freddy Funko right here. Um, some pretty cool things right there. He kind of looks like he has the little crown. He has his little outfit on. So pretty nice. I have a couple Freddy Funkos so far. I think this is probably my favorite one I got in the box. So it's robotic. Uh, he has the flag. And this one's limited to 2,000 pieces. So that's that one right there. Let's look at that one real fast. Pretty nice. Pretty nice. Not going to lie. It's a fun days 2018. I definitely do this again. Because, I mean, they're all limited. So it's kind of cool to say, like, hey, I got limited this. And then we have this one, which is probably the other cool one that I really like. The sticker's kind of peeling off, it kind of annoys me. But it's 5,000 pieces, and it's him in kind of like a blue tuxedo. And I kind of just dig that. Like, I dig it. His crown's blue at the top. I'll, let's see if you can guys can kind of get the view on that. And overall, I really like it. So, these are my Funko Pops that I got in the Funko Day Haul. Um... Not the ones I wanted exactly. I was hoping more from the the it one that was going in some of the boxes, but I liked it. Like this was pretty cool for fifty six dollars. Like, yeah, was it worth it completely? Probably not. But it's a mystery box, so I can't like totally complain. But yeah, I I enjoyed it. But I want to hear your guys' thoughts. Did you guys pick up this fun day Funko haul? Were you guys lucky enough to get one? I want to hear comments down below. Let's hear what you guys got. If you guys didn't get one, hey, maybe next year. Hopefully they do it again. Or and tell me what is one of your favorite Funko Pops. So again, if you're new here, hit that like and subscribe button because I do tons of videos like this, movie reviews, talk about movies, geeky culture, and even Funko Pops is my life. You can see a bunch right there. I got a ton more. I might be doing another haul soon for the San Diego Comic Con ones I did pick up. Other than that, guys. Hit up Sandwich on Films down below so you guys can get into more advanced movie screens. Check out some movie screens. Also, check out some movie news and movie reviews we also do. But until next time, you guys all stay classy.